All right, welcome back. Today we're just gonna be fishing out here on the pond and we're going to be using some bread and hot dogs. Just going to work on the bread on the hook. I think that's pretty good, but I don't usually go fishing like this with bread, so I'm not very good at setting up the hook. And then just gonna let it sink down to the bottom. Because I don't do a lot of fishing here, as you could tell. Okay, well, just really dirty right now. I'm not just gonna leave it sitting there, but right now I am. Then I have some hot dogs in this bag. I got hot dogs, pop tarts. Of course, they're not fishing with pop tarts. Uh, do we even have scissors? Uh, it's I'm gonna use this bag right here. Prop it up or pop the rods up so it's easier to tell when I got a bite. And we're gonna put the hot dog on this rod. If anybody knows a better way to hook up a hot dog than this, I'm going to need it because I guarantee I'll sling this thing off. Actually, I didn't. Nice. And it's further out. And then I'm just going to take the bag. Put these two somewhat close together. And then now we just wait. I'm obviously not gonna catch anything right away, so I'll see y'all once I get a bite. What's up? I'm back. I got a nice catfish on. Sorry y'all couldn't see it. Almost pulled my whole rod in the water. Yeah. He's pretty good. Sure. All right, we're back again. Sorry I had to stop y'all, but he was probably about a four pounder. He almost pulled my rod into the water because I was casting out over there, wanting to cast up towards the fountain. Uh, let's see what else we can get on this hot dog. I'm just double hot dogging it now. No point in the bread. They, they weren't even taking an interest to the bread. It took a little bit for them to get on the hot dog too, but now I'm trouble hooking it up and with the hot dog, so we'll see if that gives me better chances. That was a really far cast, actually. Just going to let it sink down to the bottom. Reel it back up. And I have a little contraption going on here. So what I do is so I set the rod down and I put this over it so the wind doesn't blow, blow it. But I'll just let it sit for right now. Guess I'm gonna go finish setting this rod up. I don't know if I should actually set it up, but we'll see if it was worth it.
Because I think that there's bigger fish over there. But I might get hung up if I even catch anything. So I'm just going to reel this rod back up. All right, now that we got it all out, I got a knot, almost just fell in the water. I got a knot in my line somewhere, found it. I don't know if I can fix it. I just gotta remember not to reel it all the way up. Oh, I got another one, y'all. Three, two. Oh, they like this hot dog. Hopefully it's actually a fish. Oh, it is. It's not a turtle. This one's smaller, so it's not the same one. That's good. This one's probably about a pound, two pounds. He does like to flop a lot. Jeez. Just trying to get. I knew he was about to flop as soon as I touched him. Oh god, this dude's got a strong mouth. Oh. I'm going to pull out the fish grippers. Jeez, this dude's just... I would be out here with my dad, so that's why I'm going to take a picture of him. but my dad had to work today. Let me check it. Y'all still on? Okay, good. Just wanna make sure that I'm getting all this. Okay, he's unhooked. Now it's time to take a pick. I might try to get my, uh... No, I'm gonna let him do it because he just got all of his, for all of his troubles, you know? Fish number two, baby. Oh, my line, my other line, might be done fishing with that rod. And he is back in the water. Let's see what I got going on over here. Oh, it wasn't that bad at all, never mind. It just looked tanned, I just lost a hot dog. I mean, it's right there, but I don't really want to reach my hand into this water. Sucks I lost a hot dog. Nice that I'm catching fish though. It's good. I'm gonna see if putting on a bit of a smaller piece of hot dog might be better. See if we can get anything on the smaller piece. Dang, oh, I was about to say this thing. Oh my god, my voice is cracking like crazy right now. All right, here we go. Can I, I'm not gonna reel it all the way up. Whoa. That thing actually casted. Sweet. Alright, let's try and get fish number three of the day. Ooh. Oh, 
I almost took myself there. I love using like the tops of the hot dogs with this type of uh, hook because I think I feel like they just stay on better. So someone told me or someone told my dad that there was Paku in here and I highly doubt that but we were going for that with the bread because I seen people catch a, some big Paku with bread and uh, but where the catfish game is going pretty good right now so I'm just gonna stick with what works. up a bit now it all looks good and sit down I'm gonna give it a little bit with y'all still on here then I'll shut y'all down and open y'all back up once I got a uh, fish All right, see you when I got another one. Another one, this one just pulled my rod into the water. Oh, he came off, thank goodness. Oh, he messed a lot of stuff up. Okay, maybe he didn't come off. Oh, but he's big. Jeez, y'all, he's a big fish. Well, for here. All right, I'm gonna go down and grab my other. Oh, I thought there was a bird right here. Forgot that I even had a fish on. Dude, like he pulled, picture? he pulled my rod into the water. Do what? He pulled my rod into the water. Maybe? Yeah. Like, look, he pulled that into it. Oh, but you're, yeah, you're able to get it. Yeah. You got a picture? Yep. Let me just fit this in his mouth. And then I'm going to get the hook out. This is my mom, everybody. There we go. Gotta be, oh, I got it. Here we go. Okay, don't get that close. Hold on. Okay, ready? Mm-hmm. He's pretty good catfish. Oh, look at that photo. What? Yeah, I know, he's pretty big. I know. Thanks for taking a picture. Okay, okay. Mom, a lady that was sitting over there? Yeah. Did you see her? No. Oh, she was just sitting right there, you caught a fish, and she goes, yeah, hey, you want me to take a picture? And then she took a picture and sent it to her son. All right, now I'm just gonna hook it up with another one and I'm gonna scooch the rods back from the water so they t so we don't have what happened again. Because I mean, it was like right here and it went whoosh, straight into the water. I wasn't recording, so I had to hit record then do all of this stuff. I wouldn't want to just watch a boring sit and wait. I'd want to watch people catching fish. So that's what I'm having them do. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, this thing got tangled up pretty badly.
Okay, well, it looked pretty bad, but it wasn't. All right. Watch out, Mama. I'm just going to take out all the moss from my line. I guess that knot is in my reel right now. I think the fish just like chilling over there. So I'm gonna cast the other rod out there as well. I mean, look, mom. Like he actually pulled it into the water. I'm mad. It's hard to reel this thing now. I'll rinse it down when we get home. What? You are? Yeah, I saw you stairs. Yeah. Then I'm gonna cast this one on out there as well. Oh, well look at that. Good thing I rolled it up because I wasn't catching anything anytime soon. Then I'm going to take another hot dog. Oh my goodness. Sorry, do you want me to move? No. It's just... <sighs> Great. Alright. Well, again, I'll start y'all back up once I got a fish on.